Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear listeners, today the 13 February World Radio Day. A very special day for the global radio. Taking the advantage of this auspicious occasion, I would like to extend my heartfelt greetings on behalf of Bangladesh Petar to all of our listeners, artists, staffs and employees who have been immensely contributing to make radio a very useful element of our daily life. At the very outset, I express my highest respect to the greatest Bengali of all times, father of the nation, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, whose lifelong struggle and charismatic leadership presented us an independent state. I also express my deep gratitude to the three million martyrs and two lakhs mother and sisters who sacrificed their life for which ultimately rested the crimson sun of the national independence and sovereignty. Dear listeners, UNESCO has announced the theme of this year, Radio and Peace, is very time-befitting, especially when the world is passing through a critical juncture due to the war in Ukraine, which eventually posed a significant threat to the whole world. Radio is an important tool in guidelining people towards peace, progress and prosperity, leaving behind all odds, falsehood and superstitions through disseminating of information, news, views and entertainment. As a powerful and easily portable medium, radio can inform and motivate people all over the world and establish greater unity among them, removing all bizarre and complications. UNESCO considers radio as a strong instrument in building peace and stability as well as eradicating conflict and controversy. On the occasion of the World Radio Day 2023, Bangladesh Betar has organized a day-long program furnished with various schedules and, of course, with the participation of good number of our dearest listeners in order to highlight the significance of radio in today's world and role of the Bangladesh Petar in ensuring peace and humanity in the society. Dear listeners, as you know, today's Bangladesh Betar has reached to this position traveling long 84 years journey with many ups and downs. At present, about 500 hours of program are being broadcast daily. Besides, programs of 20 channels of 9 stations are being broadcast through Bangladesh Betar website and Bangladesh Betar apps. Bangladesh Betar has been able to gain the trust and confidence of the people. As the largest and oldest electronic medium in the country, through its utmost commitment, respectivity and objectivity in the field of information sharing, education and entertainment. In 2006, Bangladesh Betar received the country's highest civilian award, Shadinata Padak 2006, for its outstanding contribution to build independent Bangladesh. Bangladesh Betar achieved more than 50 international awards. In recognition of the campaign related to COVID-19, Bangladesh Betar has won the best COVID response award from UNICEF. Bangladesh Betar has developed a nationwide public service network and is working to create public awareness. It is broadcasting program and news on various topics such as Delta Plan 2100, Vision 2041 of Awami League Government, Prime Minister's Special Initiatives, SDGs, Agriculture, Sports and Culture, Self-Employment, Women Empowerment, Disaster, Weather Forecast and Rural Development, etc. Since its inception, Bangladesh Betar continues to play a key role during natural disasters and environmental degradation. During cyclone, Bangladesh Betar carries out 
ट्वेंटी फोर आवार्स नन स्टप वेदार फोकस्टिंग टू क्रिएट पब्लिक अवारनेस एम टू से लाइफ एंड प्रपार्टी बांगलेश बेतार इज प्लेस बाउंड टू एक्मप्लिश अल इट्स रेसपन्सिबिलिटीज एंड डिवटीज उथ आटमोस्ट डिवशन एंड सिनसियरिटी इट उल कंटिन्यू टू वार्क टू फुलफिल दि भिशन अफ प्राइम मिनिस्टर शेख हसिना टू बिल्ड स्मार्ट बांगलेश बेस्ड ऑन गोल्डन बांगला एज ड्रीम्ड बै दि फादर अफ दि नेशन बंगबंधु शेख मुजिब रहमान अगेन आई उश अल द बेस्ट ऑन दि अकेशन अफ दि वर्ल्ड रेडियो डे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री थैंक यू अल अल्लाह हाफिज जय बांगला